we need to find the reference angle. In this case, we have theta equals, actually, I should probably do this one because I've already done because I have my two step process. Theta equals negative 7 pi over 3. 7 pi over 3. I need to start by finding an angle that is coterminal. So negative 7 pi over 3 plus 2 pi. What will that get me? Will that get me there yet? No, no, sure mom. That will only get me to negative pi over you need to 3. Do four. Still not there yet. You need to do 4. So I'll take my negative pi over 3, add another 2 pi. This one will get me where? To 1 pi? One no, pi? no, to 2 over 3. 6. 5 pi over 3? 5 pi over 3. Is that where I need to be? Yes? No? Is it between 0 and 2 pi? Sure. We're going for sure? That's yeah. between 0 and 2 pi? Yeah. Okay, now the next question is, since it's between 0 and 2 pi, what quadrant is 5 pi over 3 in? Oh, how about One, four? Two, four? Three, 4? Yeah. It's in quadrant 4. In quadrant 4, how do I find my reference angle? Um, 2 pi minus the angle, so this will be 2 angle. pi minus 5 pi over 3, which will give me a reference angle of pi over 3. So now I need to do everything in terms of pi over 3s. What's this? Well, I just need to find the sine, cosine, tangent, secant. Yes. So what's the sine of pi over 3? The sine of pi over 3? Is a... Uh... Square root of 3 over 2. What's the cosine of pi over 3? That's the 1 half one. All right, now, I've got the sine and the cosine for my reference angle. Let's go to my actual angle. What is the sine of, my original angle was negative 7, 7 pi over 3. Well, it's going to be related to the square root of 3 over 2. Is it going to be positive or negative? And how do I know? Why negative? Because I'm in quadrant 4. Your sign's going to be negative down there. What about my cosine of negative 7 pi over 3? Going to be positive? Yeah. Okay, so it's just going to be positive one half. Then for your tangent, you take your sine divided by your cosine. Yes? Um, did you figure out that it's in positive four from the daughter from the What did you do, buddy? I did it from this one. Because I found this one easy, this one easier to do than that one. Because the coterminal angles get me there each time. Into the same place, whichever one's the easiest. This one wouldn't have been.